Hi viewers and welcome to the channel and today we're going to be looking at a live build project. So I'm working with someone on the channel at the moment, giving them some help with the project that they're building. So it's a physiotherapist leg brace, but it's for the calf muscle and we're going to be creating that in the Curves Workbench. So this video is just going to go over the email that was sent and the plans. The next video we're going to be looking at the techniques going to be used in the Curves Workbench. And the third video we're going to start building the actual item from the ground up. And then afterwards, I'm going to look at controlling it all via a spreadsheet. So the viewer has reached out, given me some plans, a basic design spec, and explained to me how far they've got through the project and what problems they've encountered. So the vision I have is we wrap this object around well, half a cylinder. We could even do quarter of a cylinder, but I prefer to do half a cylinder because we can work on one side, one quarter, and we've still got a vision on the other side of how this can transfer over. And we can do any mirroring across there if we wanted to, just to get an idea of how that's gonna look in there. We've got some nice amount of dimensions. I'm not sure about dimensions here from the boundary line, which is around here to this point. And this is where I've started to think about should we go down a spreadsheet route, which makes things a lot easier to tweak these options here so we can alias these up and actually allow for that movement in there. So the first steps in this build, we're gonna go through a few techniques in the Curse Workbench. Not just teach the techniques, but also to understand if the technique is gonna work. For that, we're gonna be using a simple body that has some similarities to the object. And it's just to test out the workflow. This means if we progress down the workflow and decide that it's not the right workflow to take, then we haven't spent considerable time going down that flow with a more complex object. So that's the intro to the project. In video two, we'll start going through the techniques. And I'll leave a link here if you're interested in following along. Thanks a lot for watching, and I hope to see you in video two. If you like what you're seeing, please subscribe to the site. I also have a Ko-Fi or a coffee site that you can donate to if you so desire, and that's at ko-fi.com forward slash mang0. I also run a Patreon where you can subscribe and get extra content. And that's at www.patreon.com forward slash mango jelly solutions. Any money that's kindly donated will be used to span the channel.